So last week, Don Lemon ran to CNN to complain about Elon Musk stopping his new show and squelching f- mm-hmm. free speech. I mean, the guy's all about free speech. He's a free speech absolutist. Absolutist. Unless you disagree with him. Well, is that right? Um, they had an interview, and after the interview, uh, Elon decided, yeah, we're not going to partner with this guy. Well, now we get the rest of the story as to what actually uh, took place here. Um Ex-CNN host Don Lemon. This was tweeted out by Elon, right? No, this was... Oh, this isn't this Elon's This is a tweet. summary of the New York Post story. Okay. Uh, Ex-CNN host Don Lemon demanded $5 million advance payment. Oh, my God. <laughs> a Tesla Cybertruck. So, with the $5 million, you couldn't just buy the Tesla Cybertruck? Bro, No, I- I'm Don Lemon. Yeah, right, right. So, how about I give you none of it? <laughs> Uh, and that's obviously the decision he made. So he wanted $5 million advance. He wanted the tes- Tesla Subber truck. He wanted an $8 million a year salary and a private jet trip to Las Vegas with his boyfriend in exchange for hosting his show exclusively on X. Uh-huh. Also, he demanded the right to approve any changes in X policy as it relates to news content. Get out my face, Donnie. Ugh. He made these shocking demands during contract negotiations with X. His show uh, partnership with X was announced in January, but the deal has now been canceled after the interview with Musk. Musk then released this statement on X. The Don Lemon Show is welcome to publish its content on X without censorship. However, like any enterprise, we reserve the right to make decisions about our business partnerships. And after careful consideration, X decided not to enter into a commercial partnership mm-hmm. with the show. So there. So deal with it. Yeah. Don. How about that? Wow, that's a lot for why would you ever agree to any of that? I wouldn't pay him a dollar. No. And that's the thing. You Jeez. As a creator on there, Don, if you believe in your product, you will make money off of people flocking to watch it. Sure. Yeah. Well, that'd be the theory. So we'll see how he does over there. Yeah. No, he's not going to do well. Speaking of Musk, he had a tweet over the weekend um, underneath a post about how bad the illegal immigration crisis is in the United States. Mm -hmm. Mm. Uh, So a New Yorker speaks out about the New York City migrant crisis. Yeah. So there's a whole video of all the good stuff there. Yeah. There is either a red wave this November or America (laughs) is doomed. Imagine four more years of this getting worse. Yeah, I mean. So Elon says, vote red. Down the ticket. And this is why (laughs) the left hates him so much. Oh, yeah. Because he's come around to that now. Mm -hmm. Where else are you going to wind up? If you pay any attention to things, uh, you've got to wind up with, yeah, we have to. uh, A Republican must win in November. Oh, and by the way, there was kind of under the radar a Supreme Court decision last week, uh, 9-0, that said public officials, yeah, you can't, uh, um, you can't block users from viewing your social media posts. 